Okay, so I was fooling around with some overclockings last night on the 560, 570 rig. And I just happened to notice when I had the console on and I could see what the miner was doing that I was getting some kind of an error on what's, what was my GPU 2, uh, which is that one RX 560 that runs hot. Um, it was just kind of a little bad out of the box. It was giving me some kind of an error. Um, if you're seeing this error, then your overclocking might be too high or something like that. So I knocked the core clock back 25 and it didn't do anything. I was still seeing the error. It wasn't coming often, but it was every couple of minutes or so I would see it. So I dropped the memory clock back 100 from 22 to 2100 and I haven't seen it since. So I'm guessing just with that card, uh, there's some kind of an issue. Obviously, maybe with the memory as well. I don't know. But as far as the other two cards, those are working fine. I was able to up the memory clock on the 570 and other 100 to 2300, and that gave me that went from it was right at 30 mega hash, and now I'm at uh, just over 32 mega hash on that 570. So we're jumping into computers, we'll look at the numbers, and I'll let you know what's going on. All right, guys. See you in a bit. All right, guys, in the computer now. So let's head over to Simple Mining real quick and let me pull up my console and see if I see any of those errors. No, I don't see any of them in here. So it's been up for almost 15 hours now since I fixed the overclock. So I'll show you that real quick. See, it's this third card right here. I dropped that down to 1350. This is the 560 card. And the memory, I think I said earlier, it was 2100, but it's actually 2150. And it seems to be holding steady at that without any errors. So, as you'll see, GPU 2 there is like 0.3 mega hash. Uh, lower than the other 560, which is really nothing. Um, the good thing is that 570 is up to 32 mega hash now, whereas before it was like 30.9 mega hash. So by just bumping the overclocking on that up to 2300, I gained just over a mega hash on that. So all in all, we're up about 0 0.6, 0 0.7 mega hash from uh, the day earlier. Everything seems to be running cool. Seems to be happy, no problems. So we're all good here on Simple Miner. Head over to Mining Pool Hub. Uh, got 194 Verge coins. Uh, once I hit 250, it'll be converted over to where I hold them. So let's pull this up real quick. On my little calculator, I had already cashed out 250. So we add. 194 gives us so far 444 coins mined this week. Verge coins. That's a little more than I thought. That's pretty good. Alright, let's click over on Ethereum and see what our rolling 24 hour average is. I looked it up earlier and it was higher than it was. I don't know why this hash rate fluctuates like that. Sometimes it'll be in the 40s, sometimes I'll see it up around 90. But, I don't know, it's not very accurate. Alright, so rolling 24 hour is higher than it was yesterday. I think it was 0 .0040 yesterday. So let's copy this. Head over to Carincio and see what that equates out to. Now Ethereum is down today, so this will probably be lower. $3.61. So let's pull up my sheet again, clear that out, 3.61 divided by 2. Look at that, I did it without messing up today. It's $1.80, so that's up a little bit. 1.805, let's do that. So that means my 560s then will be at 90 cents. All right, so we're up a little bit. Um, let's change that. I don't like that. Let's go. There we go. 
so far three dollars and ninety six cents so now we got to go look at the second rig here and see what that's doing um, so far we're right now at 11880 it's about up six dollars from yesterday so let's go to my remotes see what you're doing here. Still running nice hash on this rig, but probably not for too much longer. And I'll show you why here in a bit. If you look, 93 cents on this on this uh, equihash, mining equihash. I I fixed the algorithm uh, choices yesterday, so it stops doing that dagger Hashimoto Saya coin little thing it was doing, which is pathetic. Um, but as you can see, 295 souls. 92 cents a day right now, okay? I think yesterday that was what a dollar seventeen. Let me look real quick on my chart. Dollar seventeen. Okay, right there, you see it. Boom, that's what it was doing yesterday. Now we're at 93 cents. So that's 24 cent drop. I find it hard to believe that the difficulty in the past day has fluctuated that much to where it's going to be dropping 25 cents roughly. My theory of what's going on, Nice Hash is trying to pay back the people who got ripped off, uh, which is fine. This is respectable of them. I appreciate that. They're doing it at the expense of all the miners out there. I think what they're doing is randomly skimming off the top of everyone's mining machines. So it won't always be like this. It won't always be at 0.92. This will jump back up after a while to a dollar fifteen, a dollar twenty. So they'll skim off the top for a little while, and then they'll release it, and then skim off the top, and then release it. I think they're doing this, and that's how they're paying everybody back. So I'm gonna wait till I get up to my payout, and then I'm gonna be done with nice hash. That's just me. That's just my theory. I don't know if that's true or not. But maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Who knows? We'll see, though. I'm going to be trying Awesome Miner, so when I get that all set up, I'll do a video on that and how that's doing and everything else. So let's get out of that. So that was, what, 93 cents? It was dot .93, and this was only at .17, I think it was. .17. So that's down a lot. So all in all, after electric costs, we're looking at $3.59 a day between both the rigs or $107.70 a month. I think that's down about a dollar. So once, like I said, once I get this rig right here up to up to my payout, I'm going to put it on Awesome Miner and we will, uh, we will go from there. Um... Let me see real quick the markets. As you'll see, they're down again today. Not not terribly too bad. Uh, down uh, about eight percent. I think yesterday when I did the video it was like ten thousand five hundred, something like that. But. So it is down a little more than it was yesterday. Ethereum is what I'm mining. It's down almost going on 10%. So everything's heading in the uh, wrong direction, I guess. All right. Um, I did find, I don't know, really want to know if I want to call it a deal here. Got a 580, but it's only a 4 gig. Um, for $382, and you get a mouse with a $10 rebate, so you actually get it for $372. I'm tempted to pull the trigger on that, but I'm also, I also know other people who have gotten cards, uh, i.e., Brandon Coin got one for $350, uh, RX 588 gigs. So I know those deals are out there. So it makes me a little apprehensive about pulling the trigger on this right now. I'm still thinking about it. Uh, this came up yesterday, I noticed it, and it's still here today, so I don't know how much longer it's going to last. But 
it is what it is, I guess. I guess I'm going to have to, uh, as they say, shit or get off the pot, right? Anyways, um, if you're new to the channel, be sure to uh, subscribe. I uh, appreciate you guys watching the videos and leaving the comments. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to put it in the uh, remarks section below, comment section. I'll definitely get back to you. Um, if you like the video, hit the like button. And um, if you like the content, again, be sure to subscribe and spread the word, guys. I'm trying to grow the channel, trying to uh, get more videos out to you and more content and more updates on prices and costs and what different cards are making. All right, guys. I guess that's it. I will see you all in the next video, more than likely tomorrow. Probably going to be doing another Hash Flare uh, Minor Gate review tomorrow. All right, guys. Take care.